Hi, I would like to welcome you to our presentation tonight from Hellenic American University. I appreciate you taking the time out to join us. Uh, my name is Narissa Culling. I'm the Director of Admissions and Recruitment at Hellenic American University, specifically here in Manchester, New Hampshire. Um, and then I'd like to introduce our marketing assistant. Uh, yes, uh, my name is Andy Stoltz. I am the uh, Marketing and Admissions Assistant here at Hellenic American University in Manchester, New Hampshire. Perfect. So we'll make this an enjoyable half an hour for you. Um, just to let you know what you can expect to be covered today, what we're going to cover is a history of Hellenic American University, how we started, how we relate to the campus in Athens, Greece. In addition, we're going to cover our facilities so you know exactly what the campus is going to be like since you are not able to come and tour the school right now. We'll try to make it a virtual tour. Also, we're going to cover the study abroad partnerships, um, who we actually work with, in addition, we'll talk about our Master's of Business Administration. That is the main point of being here tonight, is to learn more about that. And the surrounding area around Manchester, so you can understand the different companies that we have, our partnerships, our community outreach that is actually done by Hellenic American University. We'll cover the curriculum, as well as the ways that you can customize your MBA experience. So, first off, um, we're going to talk a little bit about the history of Hellenic American yes. University. Um, and Andy Schultz, our marketing assistant, will cover that. Yeah, um, uh, Hellenic American University is a member of the New Hampshire College and University Council's nonprofit consortium of 17 public and private institutions in, uh, in higher education in New Hampshire. Uh, Hellenic American University was originally is founded by an act of legislature here in New Hampshire in 2004. Um, so uh, these institutions in the uh, the New Hampshire College and University Council. Uh, they're always highly regarded for their outstanding teaching and research and community service. Um, and they serve as major centers uh, vital to the economic development of a community and the state. Wonderful. So you'll see here two pictures of our campus. We have the first campus, which is in Manchester, New Hampshire. That is who we're representing, as well as our campus in Athens, Greece. Now. The campus here um, actually is housed by New Hampshire Institute of Art, which covers all of downtown Manchester, and we have several different buildings. Uh, we share all the resources, including their library, their student dorms, their cafeteria. Um, also, we're near Elm Street, which means absolutely nothing to you since you probably don't know Manchester right now, but it is the hub for all of the restaurants as well as cultural experiences in Manchester. Um, in addition, you'll find that um, our apartments are close and you can walk to and from school. We have a green option that we share with New Hampshire Institute of Art where the building is all green, um, as well as another one that's within a half a block of us. Now talking more specifically about the campus in Greece, um, that is our main campus. The campus actually has writing centers, seminar rooms, um, it has an excellent cafe that you can go and have a Greek coffee at. Um, there are apartments that are available that you can walk to. Uh, they have one of the best art galleries in Athens that's housed right in the building of the Hellenic American Union, um, as well as an auditorium that actually houses a lot of cultural events. Now, I want to talk a little bit about the study abroad partnerships. We have several partnerships with University of New Hampshire, Southern New Hampshire University, Revere College, and of course, New Hampshire Institute of Art, and that's who um, we actually partner with now and share the campus, as I had said. Now, with um, those specific schools, uh, we just actually had New Hampshire Institute of Art go over for about almost a month. Uh, they had a photography class that they had taken. Uh, it was instructor-led. And so what had happened is they, they used Athens as their background in their, their classroom to go out, take photographs, as well as just get the opportunity to experience Athens as well as Hellenic American University. So if you actually check out our Facebook page, which you can contact me for, you'll be able to see some of those photographs. Now, let's talk a little bit about the, the core of our program, which I will get back to here. So, we are going to just go ahead and talk about it without the slide actually working. Um, the fundamental of our program you're going to see is, well, you can't see it, but the first one is enterprising. Um, with enterprising, enterprising in education is taking an enterprising approach to teaching and learning. Enterprise encourages all young people to learn and development in a way that meets their needs and develops their skills 
for learning skills for life as well as skills for work. Um, so you'll see here, right. <laughs> so we will hold it up. Just found this here. So this is actually the, um, the enterprising as well as professional development. You'll see we also have man managing business and um, intelligence, managing people, followed into a capstone. So thank you, Andy, for doing that. Right. <laughs> um, as for the professional development, it's a very interesting class and a very important one that we probably don't even think about. Uh, professional development is a team talk course. It's a follow-up um, to teaching you lifelong learning skills. Uh, students will approach topics such as body language analysis, emotional intelligence, appreci uh, appreciation of key managerial performance. Um, it's, these things are very important. But one of my favorite aspects of the class is the fact that you actually get the opportunity to learn how to have business, or business, proper business etiquette while you're at a business meeting. So perhaps you're at a business meeting at a dinner. Um, Dr. Um, uh, Sophia Dasku will actually teach you the proper way to hold your utensils, how to drink. Um, so these are, these are all very important things. Next is going to be managing people. I, I come from a background of organizational behavior. That is currently what my master's degree is, so it's a, it's a very important thing. So um, with organizational behavior, uh, people do not realize how important this is with an MBA. When you talk about an MBA program, typically people go into an MBA for the fact of that they want to manage people. They want to learn how to, to build a team. However, um, there are not a lot of MBAs that actually teach you the managing aspect. So we have a specific part that's an important part about managing people, where you will learn how to build an effective team. You're going to learn how to understand different personalities, how they all come together, and how you can actually motivate individuals. This is an extremely important part of the curriculum here at Hellenic American University. The next important aspect um, you're going to see um, is managing business intelligence. Business intelligence are such things as technologies for gathering, storing, analyzing, and accessing information for better business decision making. In addition, um, examples can be measuring, monitoring, key performance indicators, benchmarking, which is extremely important when it comes to the success of a business, and forecasting. Now, so we're going to take enterprising and professional development, managing people, as well as managing business intelligence, and those are all going to go into your capstone project. With the capstone project, you have a few different options. One of the options will be a 10-day business practicum, which is including your tuition to go to Greece, um, where you'll have the opportunity to work on a business plan, as well as applying different tools, such as um, you know your theories that you've learned, your tools that you've learned, the techniques that you've learned, actually applying those into a hands-on project and working with international companies. Um, this is going to give you the chance to have real life experience, real work experience. The course is going to focus on strategic management as well, you know, focusing on the entire organization. So you're going to see with the curriculum that we, um, you'll see that in a minute, that we've, we've thought of all these important components. Now let's talk a little bit though about how the MBA in Manchester, specifically Hellenic American University, fits into the community. Now in Manchester, it's a very interesting hub. You're going to see here that there are a lot of different um, companies such as Velcro is centrally located here. We have Texas, Texas in Instruments. We have Dyne Corporations. Um, Jet Boyle. We have um, a lot of culture. We have the theater. We have in close proximity to the capital as well as the airport here right at the edge of town. So this gives you the opportunity to have a lot of different international businesses right here in Manchester. Now, what Hellenic American University tries to do is we try to support the community um, by doing things such as working with the Chamber of Commerce, offering um, steep tuition discounts to different businesses that are actually in the community, especially small businesses. Um, you know, the presentation after this one, which we hope you stay around for, is actually focused on the Center for Entrepreneurship. Um, this is a huge initiative by us to support small business community as well as other um, businesses that maybe want to globalize. Now, um, the other final thing that I want to talk about here specifically with community is the fact that we do a lot of community outreach. Um, you know, we have worked with things like supporting the YMCA. Um, we are trying to support initiatives to raising money for them for Hellenic American University. Um, some other things that we're doing is, um, you know, Andrew Stoles, our marketing assistant, is working with the Chamber of Commerce on a project 
Right. All, um, all of these things are important to enabling our community here in Manchester and supporting the growth. Now let's talk about the actual curriculum. With the curriculum, you're going to see a couple of things. Um, obviously, I'm not going to sit here and read it all to you. Um, however, some of the things that I want to point out is how well-rounded it is. You're going to see your core classes, um, which I just want to be very clear. Your core classes cannot change. These are going to be the ones that are required for the program. They're going to be things such as management and organization, uh, accounting for decision, as well as operational research. Those are all going to build into more of your management functions and your management skills. Um, also, you'll get into your cross-culture management. We want to tell you that you know one of our main focus is making an actual globalized student as well as a globalized citizen. Um, we are one of the only uh, institutions that we can say in New Hampshire that actually is truly international and globalized with a campus in Athens, Greece, as well as a, ca a campus here in Manchester. You have the opportunity even to start classes here in Manchester and then go abroad as well as students have the opportunity to be from Greece, come over to our Manchester campus. Now, some other important aspects of this, obviously we talked about professional development one and two, um, but the next screen is one of the, my favorite screens. Uh, so, if we talk here about customizing your MBA experience, there's a lot of different avenues that you can take. Um, one of the you know, great things about this is the fact that we have elective courses. So you'll have your core MBA classes, you'll be able to work with the Center for Entrepreneur, and you'll be able to customize it by taking nine credits, whether it's in international business, international marketing, um, system analysis and design for healthcare. Any of these courses are actually going to be able to, be, like I said, be customized. And the great aspect of this is the fact that these courses here are all offered e-learning. So I want to talk a second about um, the different types of um, the different types of curriculum that we have here and how the class is actually laid out. So first off, you're going to be able to take a full a full entire um, course by taking one class uh, every five weeks. So the semester goes 15 weeks. So perhaps what you'll do is you'll take one class your first five weeks another class your second five weeks, and your third class your third five weeks. You'll only be going to school two days a week. It could be Tuesday um, and Saturday or Wednesday and Saturday. But during those classes, you'll also be taking an e-learning class. That is where the elective courses are going to come in. And so at any given time, you're taking a full load. However, um, the difference is going to be that you're going to get the chance to take only two classes at a time. So one class that will be on ground for five weeks, and then one class that is e-learning for 15 weeks. Now, great. Right. So, now some of the important initiatives that we actually have here is um, to make sure that we offer affordable education. When we first went to Greece, um, when we first went to Greece, uh, we started in 2004, and what we had actually done is decide to bring American education to Athens. Now. What they have currently decided to do is take the, the, the school that's been so successful in Greece and actually bring it back to the United States. So we decided to offer an MBA because an MBA is what we actually started with right. in Athens. Um, and so what we want to do, though, is make sure that we are able to offer an affordable education. Mm -hmm. With that being said, we do have a, a limited amount of scholarships that are available and that could actually offer up to 50% of your tuition um, discounted. Now, again, you would have to meet admissions requirements, which we would get to in a second. Um, and also, um, you would have to be able to um, start school in September. That is when the scholarships are for. Now, talking about tuition and fees, um, the unique thing about this is that we have a cohort format. So at any given time, we call it a rolling cohort. Since our classes start every five weeks with one e-learning class the whole way through, you can actually start classes at any given point. So whether you start in September or five weeks later in October, you're going to be going with a different cohort and staying with them throughout school. This is going to give you a chance to you know, work with different students on innovation, um, you know, collaborating with them, building a network. A network is the most important thing to any successful business person right now. So again, your cohort will be with you the whole entire time until you graduate. Now, 
first step in the application process is actually to submit your application. It's a $25 application fee. Um, with the $25 application fee, my apologies for skipping a slide too soon. Um, with the $25 application fee, after that is submitted, you'll be sent to the admissions committee and you'll actually do an interview with myself. Again, I'm Narissa, I'm the director of admissions here at Hellenic American University. Um, from there, you'll see the tuition that is actually laid out. So tuition right now is $385 per credit. And again, that's without any type of scholarships, um, which brings each three credit course to $1,155. The international business practicum, this includes the airfare. And again, I wanna say that this is an important part of the MBA. However, um, you, this is not a requirement. It is not mandatory. It is optional. Again, we had talked about the Center for Entrepreneur. So it is an option to actually go through and work with the Center of Entrepreneur, focusing more on a business plan than to go to the international business practicum in Greece. Um, the cost with the practicum, going to Greece would be $21,095. Um, if you decide not to go, um, it will be $18,095. And then you'll see there's a graduation fee of $150. So for the whole entire program going to Greece, you're looking at approximately around $22,000. If you choose not to go to Greece, then your program is going to come out around $18,200 um, approximately. So. Again, our focus is to make sure that this is an affordable education for our students, but also that is quality. All of our professors have an, um, at least a PhD um, at our Athens campus, and we also sh um, share professors with St. Anselm as one of our um, partnerships with them. Um, we also share with um, Hellenic American Education Center where they come back and forth. So again, it feeds into the fact that we're trying to make a globalized citizen and you'll get the opportunity to learn from professors who truly have international experience. Now as for the scholarship, um, we had talked just briefly about the admissions process. So after you submit your, your application, which there is a PDF on our website, um, after you submit your application, you'll be scheduled to do an admissions interview with me, either in-house here at the school at our 52 Concord Street location, or it could be done through Skype if you're not local. Um, after that, what we'll do is um, take your, your actual application, your resume, your letters of reference that are required, and in addition, your essay, and submit that to our campus in Greece and through our provost. Now, after you meet our admissions requirement, you are accepted. Again, we have scholarships that are available that are a limited amount that can reduce your tuition up to 50%. Um, this is just for us to make sure that we are offering affordable education that is quality here in Manchester and supporting the growth of our community. So what I'd like to do is um, just actually turn it over to Andy just um, for a few thoughts and then we'll take some questions. Right. Uh... Andy is fresh out of thoughts. <laughs> yeah, uh, everything's very well covered. Uh, so. so. Well, good. Well, then, you know, at this point, you'll see that with Hellenic American University, um, we have one of our offices at 156 um, Hanover Street. And then we have classrooms that are going to be um, here at 52 Concord Street. Um, so with that being said, um, you know, I want to open this up and to see if you actually have any questions at this point. Are there any questions at all? Okay, so at this point, um, if you do have any questions, you're gonna see a couple of options to contact us. The first one you're going to see is um, our phone number. It is 603-645-1800. You're welcome to call us and ask either press for the Director of Admissions or our Marketing Assistant, um, which is obviously Andrew Stoltz. Right. Um, the other option is my email address. It is NKU. L L I N G at H A U N I V dot U S. And finally, our website you're going to see is www dot H A U N I V dot U S. If you are interested in learning more about our scholarship opportunities, please email me immediately following this so that I can get in touch with you um, and we can set up a time to sit down and really discuss them. 
I would like to say thank you for joining us um, again. I hope that you contact us with any of your questions. Um, and so we hope that you stay for our, our presentation on entrepreneurs. And that will start approximately at 6 p.m. Thank you. Thank you.